Riding on that midnight train, hey, riding on home that midnight train, try to run from the pain. Not the same aim as you used to be. Now you're twice the size of me. Now that is not nice, and I apologize for that. And that is an old bluegrass standard. You probably remember it if you think hard enough, written by the Carter brothers and with the Skaggs family trio back in the early 1925. The point is this. That was a song and I played a solo to it. And where did that solo come from? Well, that solo followed the melody and it was made up by some licks. And I'd like to teach you those licks and a few more in what I call Bag of Licks 2. y'all that was your bag of licks the second edition of the guitar bag of licks now it's time to learn them right so i invite you gold pick members to go over and click on guitar tabs print off that uh, pdf file there so, or at least have it on the screen there beside the video um, so that you can follow along with me and uh, join me on the second video of this series where i'm going to break down all of these licks show you how to play them but more importantly how to put them together and then what I'm going to do at the very end, I'm going to have a rhythm tracks video for you there on the website where it will, um, I will slow it down and play rhythm for you really slow. You can have something to practice to. And I will sing and then I'll play rhythm for you so you can take a solo and back and forth and back and forth. And we'll sound like a real band. It'd be cool. All right. So come join me. We'll see you in just a sec. G Gluck number one. Let me play it for you really slow. Follow along your tab. Measure one. It's a great lick. It fits in a lot of places. Let me play a little faster. What I'd like for you to really pay attention to are the hammer-ons and the, uh, the uh, pull-offs and the slides. This particular lick has all three of those ornaments in our left hand, so we just need to make sure that we're doing those correctly and keeping our timing correct. Uh, <clears throat> if you'll notice, all of those hammer-ons, pull-offs, and slides are what's called eighth note um, ornaments, meaning that they happen at the same speed as the rest of the notes that we're playing, okay? So as for instance, uh, this pull-off here in measure one, Make sure that you don't rush that pull off. That happens the same speed as if you were to pick every note. One and one and two and three. Um, I don't want you to be doing and pulling it off really fast. There's times when we might want to do that, but for this particular lick, let's keep this nice and even. It's uh, 16 eighth notes in a row. One and two and three. 